starting up a business or developing a business is a journey and you need a very strategic map with the end in sight, the vision that you have to climb to the top, the mission is what you're going to do to get there and then the values is how you do what you're going to do. And that's what the Sherpa map delivers. You take all of the information from your business plan, whether it be a six page plan, a one page plan or a 40 page plan, and you transpose that into the map. That map can then be published internally so that all and sundry, particularly management and employees, all stakeholders know exactly the journey that everybody's going on. As a result of that, you get greater productivity, you save costs in terms of resources, and more importantly, time. We're all going the same direction, singing off the same hymn sheet. Yeah, I, I think the key thing with, with Sharp is allowing you focus. And, and a big thing that's startups and small businesses and established businesses, you know, we, you're so busy being in business and just doing the business of being in business that actually working on your business is, is very tricky you know and I think everybody can identify with that if you're in business and again every business is about return on investment for a startup business they generally speak have a small amount of money they don't have an awful lot of time we can't waste money and we can't waste time they're the most important resources you have setting up a business so what I want to do is help people shortcut it's often said that when setting up a business, it takes twice as long and twice as much than what you anticipated. What I want to do is set the right time frames at the right amount of money and stick to the plan. The way it has helped me uh, devise a strategy is that you, you get to take a, a very realistic look of the time frame of what, of what you need to do, how, what you need to generate to make your business successful, how you will start, how you will progress it. And it helped to give a grounding to, to start, to get you started, but to also get you thinking six months ahead, one year ahead, two years ahead, five years ahead. It gave you, it gave, provided a roadmap to help you course the way through this. So if you do deviate, you have something to go, well, hang on, this isn't where I intended to be. I need to pull it back. And if, if you may get successes or pluses or minus on either side of that, but I think when you have a clear route to help you focus through, that's uh, that's what it has helped me with. It's helped me to kind of steer a course and keep it as straight as possible. Now that will be updated from time to time because you'll have your strategic goals for the next three years or more. Then you'll have the tactics which you have to deliver over the next 12 months. And then you will have the operational issues that you have to deliver day by day. That's broken down by department. So for example, you will have Finance will have a section, marketing will have a section, management information systems, R&D. So all of that can be brought together in one place. Having Sherpa and that framework there as, as a, a point of focus, you know, and, and having Thomas and the Sherpa team go through you, go, go through uh, that framework with you, support you, make sure that you're being held accountable, that you are actually sort of doing what you said you were going to do, or you th that you said to yourself that you were going to do, you know, so having that outside perspective is really important, so. From then on, it's into the, how you will go about that, how you will set a business plan in place, what you're going to do, what's your mission statement, and you sort of aim out a number of years, you know, or three months or six months, and it gives you something actionable to say, right, this is what your plan is, this is how you're going to refine it to be your product, this is what it's going to help others do and then this is where you need to go and the biggest problem that people have in managing people is that they fully appreciate the vision and mission of the organization so what we do or what i'm doing in terms of the people management end is is to help them understand as employees very clear what their aims and objectives of their job is in the context of the vision and the mission of the organization.